couldn't bring myself to sleep in our bed alone. Well, we lost him, Iris. When HR died, we had a funeral. Maybe we should give us all permission to grieve. What are we gonna bury, Dad? The empty suit in the lab? It's up to us to protect this city, because there is no one else. Just us trying to keep the city safe, we're barely getting it done. We need to bring Barry back. No. Barry told us to keep moving forward, not to save him. What is your deal? It's like you don't even want him back. Are you certain that Barry is even still alive? Iris, he's gotta be. You need to believe that there is an answer for every question. Barry's trying to send us a message, I know it. You got strength, baby girl. We just need a little faith. Let's bring our boy home. I tried to keep going. To keep running like you said. Please come back to me. You need to prepare yourselves. Barry? Bring the Flash. This guy's no joke. He said he wants to fight the Flash. I made you a new suit. You want to take it for a spin? What is good YouTube? Hopefully you're all having a good day. And today in this video, I'm gonna be talking about three things we learn from the new Flash season four trailer that came out just a few minutes ago at the time of me recording this video. Yes, another Flash season four trailer has come out. We had another trailer come out last week and a second one has already come out this week. So before we get into the three things, if you're new to the channel, subscribe to the channel to get more videos like this and make sure you hit that notification button for my subscribers so you don't miss out on my future videos. Like this video, share this video with your friends as well. And I also want to ask if any of you specialize in doing intros, then be sure to private message me on the back end of my YouTube channel because I am looking to update my intro, maybe a flash style intro for my flash videos, an arrow style intro for my arrow videos, etc. So if you specialize in that, then message me on my YouTube channel. So let's get into the three things we learned from the Flash season four trailer. The first thing we learn from the trailer is that Joe has already accepted that Barry isn't coming back and is willing to do some kind of funeral for Barry. Iris is kind of reluctant and we also know that Iris misses Barry as seen in the trailer. So it'll be interesting to see how Iris will deal with the loss of Barry right before Barry comes back. I'm intrigued to see how she copes with it. So the second thing that we learn from the trailer is that Cisco is pushing to get Barry out of the Speed Force because he feels that the team needs him in order to protect Central City from the new metahumans created by the Speed Force storm. Cisco mentioned in the trailer that they're doing all they can but it's not enough, they still need Barry. And of course, Cisco still has hope that Barry is alive, but Iris is questioning whether or not Barry is still alive. But Cisco, he still has faith. And by the end of the trailer, we see that the team has come to the conclusion that they need to get Barry out of the speed force. What could have triggered this? What could have possibly persuaded Iris to get Barry out of the speed force? Well, in the previous trailer, we saw that the samurai kidnapped Iris and we saw it again in this trailer. So maybe Iris didn't even have any say on whether or not Barry should come out of the speed force. Maybe as soon as Iris got kidnapped, they decided, nope, we need to take Barry out of the speed force and that is how he comes out. And the third thing we learn from the trailer is that Barry gets out of the speed force through the help of Team Flash. They use some kind of device and this device is probably most likely made by Cisco. And this is obviously to free him. And in my trailer breakdown, the one that I uploaded last week, I speculated that Barry got out of the speed force on his own due to him not being able to handle the trauma he's experiencing in the speed force. And of course, this trailer trailer confirms that I was indeed wrong because Team Flash is the one that's going to bring him out. But how does Cisco know how to make something that will get Barry out of the speed force? Well, 
in the Flash Season 3 finale, Savitar forced Cisco to alter the Speed Force bazooka so that he can spread himself across time, but instead, Cisco altered the Speed Force bazooka to get Jay Garrick out of the Speed Force. So maybe this device that they used to get Barry out of the Speed Force is the Speed Force bazooka, the same one, just with a few moderations. Maybe the Speed Force bazooka brings Barry out in a way that doesn't cause the Speed Force to become unbalanced once again. So those are the three things that we learned from the new Flash Season 4 trailer. What do you guys think? Are you excited for Season 4? And how do you think Cisco made this new device that got Barry out? Share your thoughts down below in the comments. So if you like this video, give this video a thumbs up, share this video with your friends, subscribe to my channel if you're new, and I'll see you guys later for more videos.